Are you fed up with staring at the same dull, uninspiring, and cluttered desktop every day? Yeah, I was too. That's why I spent hours searching the perfect tools transforming your PC from this boring look into this sleek, minimalistic black and white masterpiece. In this video, I'll show you how to achieve this unique overlayer effects for your clock. You'll also learn how to add a sleek, minimalist top bar that enhances multitasking, and I will show you some desktop widgets for useful information as well as a dark light taskbar. So let's get right into it. Now let's start with removing all those messy desktop icons. This step is very easy. Just right click the home screen, then go on view and there uncheck show desktop icons. Now this way your desktop looks a lot cleaner and is not cramped with icons, but don't worry you can still open your apps very fast by just simply using the search function. Now let's really spice up your desktop with the aesthetic and minimalistic wallpaper. We have chosen this clean black and white one, so let's download it from the link in the description. Or you head to our website where you can find everything you need and more in one place. After the download, you just simply need to, again, right click your desktop, but this time go to personalize. In the settings, click on background and then on browse photos. This will open the file explorer where you can select the downloaded wallpaper. Click here and we are done with the step. Now if you ask me, this already looks a lot more organized and professional, but let's take it a step further with some real changes to the UI. For this, we will install a really handy tool called Sealin UI. You can visit the website with the link in the description. On the site, click on the Microsoft Store and download it from there like shown here. First, let's remove the wallpaper as we are using our own one. To do this, click on wallpaper and disable the switch here. And very important, click on save. With the tool installed, the new taskbar and the toolbar at the top of your screen should already be applied. If it's not applied, go into the fancy toolbar settings and toggle this switch on. Then head over to the taskbar settings and enable it there as well. Don't forget to hit save. Now let me quickly show you how to make the top bar even more aesthetic. This time go on general. Here select bubbles under the available themes and move it over with the arrow here. Now hit save and your top bar should have this bubble like look. Generally speaking, this top bar is both functional and aesthetic. For example, you get this clean and minimal audio interface which is easy to use. And speaking of functionality, you can find another great feature under window manager. Here simply enable tiling window manager and save the settings. And now you have the ability to arrange any apps automatically in this split screen, perfect for multitasking. As the last step for this tool, we will remove this media player as we will install a proper one later. To do that, right click the module and click remove here. After all of these steps, your desktop looks already much better and you have a very unique taskbar and top bar that even brings some functionality to your desktop. Now for the next tweaks, we will be using a tool called Rainmeter. It's the go-to app for Windows customization and it makes it super easy to install plugins to create widgets and more. You can download it with the link in the description. The installation is very easy, just run the file and everything will install automatically. The first thing we will install is the Jax Core plugin. It's a powerful tool that gives you some great widgets to enhance your desktop. Again, you can use the link from the description to download it. Now let's set it up by running the file we just downloaded. Here type Y to proceed the installation. After this step, Jack's Core will automatically open and you're graded with this menu. Click get started to start the setup. In the next menu, just click on continue every time. Here hit proceed to get to the last step. Now in this menu, unselect these two tools and scroll to the bottom to select modular clocks and modular players. To finish the setup, click install. If this is not working, try disabling your antivirus for a short time, as Jackscore is sometimes seen as a false positive by these tools. Just make sure you install the official version. Now it's time to properly set up all the tweaks. Let's start with the aesthetic desktop clock. Normally this menu should already be open. If it's not, click here to open the system tray, then click on Raymeter here. Then in the app, open the folder named Jackscore. Now open the main folder and select this file and click load. To set up the clock, go to the library and in the menu click on modular clocks. Then go into the general tab and there we will select this cool minimalistic clock design. Before we activate the clock, we have to change the color under the styles option. To change the color, to black left click here and type 000. Now activate the clock and place it in the center of your screen. The next thing we will set up is the modular player widget. In the library click on modular player and then again go into general. Select this design and then go to style options. Here select standard for the round corners and activate the widget. Place the widget in the bottom left corner. As the last step in Jack's core, we will now set up the unique overlayer effect I showed at the beginning. In the library, click on overlayer and then download the plugin. Now, before we proceed with the setup, we need to open the wallpaper image and remove the background from it so we can seamlessly overlay it on the full image. This can be done by clicking on edit in the Windows Photo app and then you just need to click on the background removal tool. As you can see, the background wasn't really removed properly. 
You can fix this by activating the brush tool here. Now just remove all the wrong selections and don't forget to click remove when you are finished. After that, save the image as a copy. Now go back to the Jack's Claw settings and go to general. Click here and select the image we just created. Now just activate the plugin. To arrange the clock behind the overlay or right click it go to Z layers and then set the layer to negative 2. If you ask me this already looks pretty stunning and especially the clock behind the wallpaper is an eye catcher. Also the widget looks really modern and brings some more functionality to your desktop. Now let's round up the setup by installing some more modern widgets. For that we will get the Monterey skin for rain meter. Go to the description and download the mod from there. After the download let rain meter install the plugin. Now in the settings navigate to widgets and enable the calendar, monitoring and notes widget. Let's customize the widgets a bit. Right click the widget and enable wide. Now do this for all the widgets. When you are done arrange the widgets like I did in the bottom corners of your screen. If you go into the settings again you can also use other styles for the widgets. Just go on appearance and change the style. Now let's appreciate the finished design. We now have a really professional looking desktop setup with informational widgets and a unique 3D effect with the clock. Besides that, we also have level up your taskbar to a way simpler look and you now also have a great top bar that brings a lot of shortcuts to the desktop. Performance wise, it is a bit heavy with the Jack's Core Rampter skin which tends to take some performance and the Sealand UI tool also has some bugs from time to time, so keep that in mind. If you want to know exact information, check out our full video on this topic. If you want to build this setup or another one of our setups, just head to our website for all the links. All in all, we hope you enjoyed this tutorial and we kindly ask for a like and a sub.